Welcome friends and family. In the case of Nick and Sydney, fans and followers. <laughs> to an amazing day where two wonderful people are making their commitment to be married and to become partners together in this thing we call life. If you know me and Sydney, you probably know we're not the most overtly serious people. I don't even know what we're saying half the time. But we truly became the friends we are because at the age 11, we knew that we could trust each other more than anyone I've met in my adult life. That instinct was correct, and I've shared every secret and gone through every good and every hard time with her ever since. So, to make a long story short, we are so happy, the Weeby family, everybody that's come here from out of town. This has been the most wonderful weekend of our lives. Good? It's beautiful. Okay. Thank you, sweetie. Yeah. I'm Mike Perazzo, a family friend of the Weebies and a super fan of this bride and groom. Sydney, you have been an amazing blessing to Nick and a wonderful addition to our friends and family that are assembled here today. I ask that you protect, comfort, and support Nick now and forever. Till I saw you for the first time I saw you for the first time You opened my eyes I saw everything Marriage is the highest stage of friendship where you fall in love with the same person many times over. A healthy marriage fosters an environment of safety, faithfulness, commitment, and reliability. Many of you may not know this, but I was in the unique position to watch Nick fall in love with Sydney. I watched him move from curious, to interested, to completely captivated, to where we stand today. As a congregation, we pray for you in Sydney. We'll do everything we can as your family and friends to help you guys achieve your dreams. Sydney and Nick, I love you both so much and I'm so excited for our lives together. Nick told me last night that more than anything, he wants all the people that are here to meet and love each other. So I hope that we can all do that and get to know each other and raise a glass for Sydney and Nick. Cheers. <laughs> Cheers. Anybody who has a daughter knows that their father loves their daughter the most. And for me, <laughs> for, me for me to see that, yes, I have a son, but we'll, we'll talk about that. <laughs> so anyway. Hi. I can't explain to you how much we know this man loves Sydney. Everybody that's here, you've traveled many miles to come to the Eastern Shore, Cape Charles, small little town, and we can't thank you enough for coming. Nick? You are the best possible outcome a friend could ask for when your best friend tells you she's going to visit someone she met in her Instagram DMs. Uh, my parents have been asking him, when are you going to meet somebody? We need a girl. One day my mom calls me. He's talking to a girl. I go, have you met her? She goes, no, he hasn't even met her. She's from California. I go, this dude, he made this up all the way. Kevin, she's on TV. Okay. So Nick has an imaginary internet TV girlfriend. 
that no one's met, but she's totally real. What's a man gotta do? What's a man gotta do to get close to you? I spend my time in the shadows looking for proof. But I can't open the blinds no matter what I do. This night is obviously about us, but it's it's truly about every everyone in this room. You're here for a reason. We love you all. You've had a tremendous impact on our lives. We hope everybody in, gets to meet, you know, each and every one of the people that are in this room that have made uh, Sydney and I who we are, and just enjoy each other's companies as much as we do. It is my honor to pronounce you husband and wife. Nick, you may kiss your bride. I present to you Mr. and Mrs. Nicholas Weeby.